Hey guys, had somebody that uh, had a question about setting up the MPC with uh, Synth 1 running on their iPad, so I'm just going to show how to do this real quick. First things first, I'm going to go to my MPC and make sure Bluetooth is turned on. Uh, for some reason it wasn't. And so I turned it on here, and I'm going to connect my MPC Live 2. This is all assuming that I'd followed the steps in one of the previous vi videos I put together. I got connected here, so I'm good here, and I can see it's connected down there. Um, next up, just so you know, on the back, I've got going into the MPC live inputs, I've got just an eighth inch to quarter inch uh, stereo jack, so quarter inch are plugged in the back. Here for my iPad, I've got USB-C to eighth inch, so this is just to carry the audio because you can't do audio over MIDI. And from here, we should be pretty much set, so... Let us get in here. Music, uh, apps, let's see, where's Synth 1? Do, 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 do. There we go, Synth 1. So first question will be, is, are we able to send notes? So uh, I've got my MIDI port set here. The track is set to MIDI type and you can see notes are playing over here, no sound. So what we need to do is go to the sampler and turn monitoring on. It's pretty low, but we can hear it. So hopefully that helps you get set up, but the important thing to remember is MIDI doesn't carry out any audio data, so you have to get the audio from your device out through like a cable like this into the, your input on your MPC and make sure you have monitoring turned on. From there, you can do all kinds of fun things like go into your auto auto sampler or you can, can uh, record loops or other stuff. Anyway, hope that helps you guys out. Peace.